Yeah. Became a big embarrassment. Ah, it became was so a big one. All right. In the last three weeks, elections have been won and lost in Nigeria with lessons learned. A Nigerian businessman based in Abia State, Steve Babi, has gifted a new Toyota Prado SUV to the Abia re Returning Electoral Commissioner, Rec Professor Nena Oti, for keeping her integrity during the electionary process. This was disclosed in a statement on his Facebook page on Thursday. He wrote, for your outstanding service to the people of Abia, I hereby request for this Prado to be delivered to Mrs. Nena Oti immediately after arrives in Nigeria next month. Recall that the wreck allegedly rejected a whopping $2 million bribe to burn. Some people stood high. Some people, when they see money, at, you know, in the call of their duty, it's not everybody, it's not everybody in Nigeria. We're not all corrupt. Mm, no. $2 million is a tidy retirement benefit. Game changer. Honestly, mm. retirement benefits. Game changer. Is Life like, changer. Mm. Life changer. For man. this woman, she would have just maybe relocated them so, uh, abroad and just. You see, to, the truth also is that in the era of beavers, mm. it's difficult to get away with such things. To mm. simply write, you can't write figures anymore because they will call for beavers. What is in the beavers report? Mm. But the beavers is not just going to do accreditation, it will also be able to send a report of its own. Uh, all the uh, parties, they now have, you know, during the Obasanjo era, there was nothing like situation room. Hmm. But our, our electoral process has become much more advanced that parties now have situation room. You are monitoring it. Your agents are they communicating. This is the era hmm. of social media. When uh, uh, these phones first came, you could not even snap pictures with them. No, 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 no. Now, no data. You can, yes, you, you just can, call. No, so, no mm -hmm. uh, data. No. Mm -hmm. But these days, you can do a whole lot of things mm -hmm. with this. Motorola talk about this. Yes, <laughs> where, where are you going to do video, <laughs> video call? You can't do video call. Yeah. 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 Buy one, get one free. So, now, the truth is, it's a lot more difficult. I'm not. By this, try to say the woman, the woman did not do it. Uh, but the it is a lot more difficult now. So, officers were kidnapped on the way to um, collation center. The same result still prevailed. You can't do anything about it anymore. Everyone has his own copy, every agent. What are you going to say? They filled this form EC8A. Oh. Everybody, they've snapped it. They have their copies. How are you going to alter it? People think that it's still like before. Mm. It's, a, it's, not, it's not that easy. More complex. See how long it took before they concluded the Zamfara thing. Mm. Those guys were whisked on their way to deliver, uh, on their way to collation center. The same result was still what was, was announced because you cannot change it. They put policemen there. They waited, wasted their time. In the end, the results still mm. prevailed. Mm. So... I congratulate the woman, you know, women always stand firm in things like this. I congratulate the woman for and the person who bought a car for himself and then decided that, look, let me give it to this woman. The, the truth is, the joy of finally seeing the back of PDP in that state and electing someone who is popular, Alex Oti, no doubt about it, deserve to win. Mm. He deserves to win. I think this is like his third attempt. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. As, you know, I, I yeah. predicted it. I said, this is, his, this is his best opportunity to become a governor. And he won. Because he had contested since 2015, he's been contesting. So, kudos to this woman. And it still shows that there are good Nigerians. Nigerians who can part with anything just so that we can achieve growth mm. and development as a country. These are the kind of people that deserve to be rewarded, not criminals. Uh, no. See, if someone stays faithful, the reward will come. It may not be immediately. This is a lesson. I don't know whether she will take the money, uh, we will take the car, but look, the gesture is a good one. 
She did not compromise. Mm. She stood firm. Mm. See how long it took. Mm. At the end of the day, what are you going to do? The guy was leading by an audacious margin. The result of Bingwa cannot uh, overhaul the lead because the lead was massive. On a syllable lead. Yes. Uh, and during that time, even one of the candidates had considered. He had congratulated the man because he knew the way this thing was going, Oti had been elected. So why, why make all this effort? And that's why when the governor even congratulated Oti, Oti was not impressed. Mm. Because Oti Shut was referring to, time. Oti was even referring to the efforts made, the kidnapping of, uh, of uh, INEC staff and all that in the desire to just make sure that they that change that Obingwa uh, uh, resolve. But in the end, uh, OT won, and uh, it's, it's just something that makes me happy. We said it earlier. It's like congratulations to the people of Anambra as a whole. Abia. Abia, the people of Abia as yes. a whole. Yes. It They've is. not had it so good. Yes. Um, it's good congratulations and um, to our neighboring states. Um, I'm from Imo. Abia is free. And I also pray that one day Imo will be free. That is what we've been praying for. Uh, because when you look at the trajectory and look at some of these, our leaders, and what they pushed us through, you're not going to ask, are we from the same planet? Mm -hmm. What Oti has done is putting a stop to uh, what we call the dynasty of Ojus of Kanu in Abia State that started in 1999. Ojus of Kanu was elected as um, a governor of Abia State with so much hope. The election in 1999 for Ojus of Kanu was so overwhelming that the people of Abia felt that this is the man that can do the job. Because of his pedigree in business and the rest of them, they believed that he could have bring, he would bring that to the table. But all just spent eight years in Abia, and not much, he couldn't show much for it. He went ahead not only after eight years, but also to nominate his chief of staff, T.A. Oji, who was in prison as of the time of the election, that one won, and also ruled for another eight years. That's 16 years. Mm. The, um, um, now, Okeze Ikbazu, nominated by TOG, also was there for another, <laughs> another eight. So you can imagine what has happened. And there was so much expectation from most of these um, governors, young governors. But uh, that wasn't much. Like TA, uh, um, um, Okeze Ikbazu, people felt that, you know, that ABBA is the hub center of the commercial activities of Abia State and even to a larger state, the Southeast. Oh, and Melio felt that so much could be done within ABBA. He tried his best, uh, best, whether his best was enough. But when you look at the massive celebration, there's no state in Nigeria. Out of the 28 look, um, um, governorship election that was said, uh, I never, probably in Kano, compared to Kano. Now you see that kind of celebration. I didn't see that in any other state, mm. apart from uh, Kano. Yeah, and sure. they showed that people were. Then back to the professor, the mother. Well, congratulations to her. You know, she came out and said that she is going to, she's, she said her job, her integrity as a professor was, asked. this is the vice chancellor of FUTO, Federal University well, of Technology, technology of yes, and she said that she's not going, to, she said she's not only a lecturer, but also a pastor in a church. You understand what I'm trying to say? So she was not ready to compromise, mm -hmm. and that is what, so at the end of it, she delivered. But there was something that Dajide uh, 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 said that I totally agree with, that is the issue of beavers. I was watching OT two days ago on the national TV station where he was interviewed after the election. And he said it was this same Obingwa that was used to rob him, I think in 2019 or 2015, I think 2019, that he was leading until he got to, and that is what has been used. He said the result that came in after this, he was leading. The next thing they brought from Obingwa, they said it's over 90-something thousand votes. No, it's something that it ate. From there, they moved to 90. From 90, they moved to 103,000. And they said no. Then he thanked INEC also, because what they now did was now go to the back, go back and check the beavers, the back end mm. of beavers. I realized that PDP only had 9,000 9, votes in, uh, in, <laughs> in Obingwa. Uh, and and <laughs> we had 3,000 something votes. That technology was, that technology was magic. So if there wasn't that, that, that technology, mm. and that was how some of us said that. We, I personally have said it time and time again that Bifas will be a changer if we agree to allow it to work. Mm. But if we continue to there's compromise it, yes, it. there's some places mm. that they allow it, allow it. And that is why we're having some of the challenges. Because Professor Yakub Mahmoud would have written his name 
in so much oh, things. If some of the people time that were working so under uh, him uh -huh. allowed the system to work, well, mm. you can see what happened. And look, the same thing is happening if, if you look at Adamawa mm. and the rest of them. Mm. It's the same thing that's happening. If not, some people would have written results and just announced. 